Well, I stopped here on the side of the road. I want to give you guys an update. Uh, I got new tires. Thank you to American Tire Discount. Uh, check that shit out. They did a good job. They were awesome people here. Uh, I'll give you an update on that one when I let, when I get to a better place. This is how fucking Wyoming looks, okay, everybody? It is nothing but grass field, grass field. That's it. Grass field everywhere. All grass field. I don't know what the fuck these fools be growing grass for, but they're growing a lot of grass out here. I guess that's hay, huh? I don't know. But, uh, so, I just left uh, Cheyenne, Cheyenne, Wyoming. I'm on my way right now to, uh to somewhere and i will let you guys know uh when i get there but so i just want to let you guys know i'm leaving i left um uh, headed on my way already new tires full tank of gas uh got hooked up with the credit card for tire discount place american tire discount if you ever go to cheyenne wyoming that's the only place worth visiting in cheyenne wyoming is american tire discount they were awesome people there, really awesome people. Authentically happy to see me, um, authentically happy to serve me, um, to help me. Uh, just trying to uh, get get on to the next place now. So, everybody, that's what's going on. That's what happened. This is China. This is Wyoming. Uh, I would not visit Cheyenne, Wyoming. People in Cheyenne, Wyoming. I would have to say statistics overall for Cheyenne, Wyoming is uh, about 1 out of 50, 1 out of 40. Uh, I ran into about 40 people, one person actually helped me. So uh, 40 or 50 people I ran into and one person actually helped me. So 1 out of 40 or 50 people is actually good people in Cheyenne, Wyoming. That's not counting more Rock Springs because Rock Springs is different. Um, in Rock Springs, everybody's trying to mind their own business for the most part, except for some of the shop owners. Uh, some of the shop owners are kind of prejudiced against the homeless, but they kind of got over it. Um, I did have a... Uh, so I say well, Rock Springs and Cheyenne, Wyoming are different statistics. One out of 40, 50 people in uh, Cheyenne, Wyoming, and then Rock Springs, Wyoming, I'd have to say like one out of... Uh, I ran into one, two, three, four, five, six. I ran into seven, eight, ten. 10 people and one person was actually trying to help me all the rest were just kind of like throwing their personal opinion into the affair and kind of making the situation worse and like judging me and following me around and looking in my car my vehicle and watching in my vehicle but the walmart out there i believe the walmart out there and walmart in cheyenne wyoming actually i have to give them both credit because they were really awesome about letting me stay uh in their parking lot even though i I stayed a little bit longer than I should have. They were really fucking awesome about it. I give uh, Walmart and Cheyenne and in Rock Springs both props. Uh, you guys are awesome. Thank you for helping me out. Uh, letting me get back on my feet so I could continue my journey. Um, a shout out to them. Shout out to American Tire Discount in uh, Cheyenne, Wyoming. Because uh, American Tire Discount in Cheyenne, Wyoming, they were very authentic. Very happy to help me. Very uh very nice people. I believe his name was Dalton. Dalton was a very great guy. If you guys are in Cheyenne, visit Dalton at American Tire Discount. He's going to hook you up, help you out as much as he can. Uh, Dave's Tires, uh, you can check them out. They were awesome. They helped me out. They're really awesome people too. Make sure you check them out in Cheyenne, Wyoming. Uh, of course, Walmart. Walmart's awesome. They helped me out a lot. Um, always with the great prices. Uh, also, Rock Springs, Wyoming, uh, I believe his name is Clint. Clint helped me out in Rock Springs, Wyoming, and the only good motherfucker out there. Um, other than Walmart, Walmart really looked out for me. Uh, so, that's about it. Uh, when I get to the next spot, I'll let you guys know I'm burning gas, so I gotta get the fuck up out of this spot. I'm about to hit the freeway right now. I just wanted to give you guys an update. Peace. Keep your life positive. Cause that's all you have is positivity in your life anything else is not guaranteed you could guarantee positivity by putting it out